Got to get something to eat. Got to get, I ain't ate all day. I'm hungry and that's it. I'm just ready to eat. I've been eating the same food for the past, oh my God, for so long. <laughs> Your jubilation, these words coming from a man who served nearly 14 years in prison and today he was released. In Michigan now's Chloe Godbold has been following this story and has more on how his family has long awaited for this moment. Is it real? Is yes, it's real. It real. real. <laughs> It's been nearly 14 long years since Michael Anthony Griffin has been a free man. But Wednesday afternoon, this dream became a reality. Never thought I'd see him again. Never thought I'd see him again in the free world. They was there with me through the whole time I was in prison. But I never thought I would see him in regular clothes. Never thought I'd see him outside like this again, man. This, this, this don't feel real. This does not feel real. It just don't. Man. I don't. I don't know. I don't know. In 2010, Griffin was convicted of felony murder and child abuse for allegedly abusing and killing his daughter, Navia Griffin. With support testimony of seven doctors, the state argued that Griffin intentionally abused his daughter, either by shaking and slamming her, causing her death. In 2020, the Michigan Innocence Clinic brought the case to the Mike Morris law firm. And on Monday, attorney Mike Morris argued a bond motion in Genesee County Circuit Court. The judge ordered that Mr. Griffin can get out of prison on a surety bond and be with his family and be able to consult with his lawyers and try to regain his life after sitting in prison for 13 and a half years after an unjust and unconstitutional trial. Now Griffin is finally a free man. It feels different. It feels different. I'm not walking the yard no more. Oh. So many family members waiting in anticipation to see their loved one who they haven't seen in years. Ooh, my son is free. It's been hard, but God has been with us. God has got us through this. Yes, he has. Tammy Griffin, his mother, says it's been hard not having her son around for more than a decade, missing out on so many of life's precious moments. A lot of birthdays, Christmas, everything, everything. John Knock Hazel, an attorney with the Mike Morris Law Firm, says this moment is what lawyers live for. They say every time it feels the same, but this is the highlight of people on my team's legal careers. They've been doing it for 20, 25 years. Never done something like this and, you know, life changing for them. I've, I've only been doing it for two years, but, you know, definitely a, the high point so far. Chloe Godbold reporting Mid Michigan Now. Attorneys say now it's up to prosecutors whether or not the case will be retried. But for now, Griffin says he's going to spend as much time with family as possible.